Looking at the two hole, but staying out there. Time standstill is third. Golden Shot Killeen is fourth. The opening quarter in 26 seconds. That's Village Connection on the lead in Oive. Finally relented and took the tuck in from second. He's two lengths in arrears as Village Connection is stepping right along, opening almost three lengths on seven rivals into the backstretch. Oive is second time, stands still as third. Golden Shot Killeen starts the flow. He's first to sacrifice on the outside, fourth. Fifth on the outside, second over is Slick Pavement, brought out from six Pacific Fella. Then Dr. Lecter Lobel and winning goalie. The half is 54 seconds, and they move into the final turn, and Village Connection is still tugging hard on McDonnell and not allowing any of his rivals to get close to him. Following up in second is Benoit Ve, Golden Shot Killeen is uncovered on the outside third time, stands still as fourth, Slick Pavement a second over fifth. On the outside sixth for Pacific Fella, then Dr. Lecter Lobel and winning goalie to the rear of the field. Village Connection clicked off three quarters in one, 21 and four, 27 and four, third quarter in the second derby elimination. Village Connection brings it into the stretch He's been the leader at every call. Here comes Pacific Fella setting sail on that leader on the outside. Winning goalie last all the way is picked up third. Golden Shot Killeen. Here comes Pacific Fella against Village Connection on down to the end. Pacific Fella with a monstrous upset at 49 to 1 in 150 and 3 over Village Connection. And it was tight for third. Slick pavement against winning goalie Pacific Fella with a monstrous Canadian pacing derby upset. Number four, Pacific Fella. Cam Fella, four-year-old, from One More Kiss. Owned by Ed Lohmeyer of New Jersey, Peter Heffering, and John Stoddard of Ontario, New Jersey. Trained by Sean Robinson of the Bill Robinson Stable and driven to victory by Randy Waples. His eighth win in 20 starts this year. Lifetime best of 150 and three. Longest shot on the board at 49 to one takes the second elimination of the 1997 Canadian Pacing Derby. Pacific Fella. Pacific Fella was the longest shot on the board in the second elimination of the Canadian Pacing Derby and here's his driver Randy Waples to tell us about it. It's pretty amazing what a guy will go through to get to stand out here beside you isn't it? <laughs> it certainly is but I doubt that's why you're here because I'm sure that the, the 50,000 at the top of the page was part of it plus more than a quarter of a million next week Randy but this horse went into the race as an underdog of course and, and the betting public shows that on the board he paid a lot and uh, here he is and he was quite a ways back it looked like you were trying to get a second over trip up the backstretch Ended up with a third over trip, but it didn't matter. No, he was really good. And, uh, you know, Golden Shot Clean is a tough horse first over. It's tough to pull on him early because he'll hang out there. And then when you do move on him, he'll go with you. So it, it's kind of, he's a tricky spot to be in when he's first over. You don't want to move too too early. But he was so full of pace around the last turn that I kind of moved him about three quarters of the way through it, which is, he went a huge trip. He really was. He was an awesome animal to drive. And, uh, you know, I, I really appreciate everybody putting me down on him and that. And, uh, you know, I, I wish him all the luck in the final. Well, we'll have a chance to see the stretch drive. Now, this horse raced at two, missed a full year, and now he's back as a four-year-old, and he's racing terrific. Now, here you are, Randy, and uh, you've made your move. You can tell us about the horse, especially the end of the mile, something you mentioned to me. Yeah, well, he, he kind of got running in a little wee bit at the end of the mile there, but I think that would be more just the case that he hasn't been that fast in quite a while, you know, and uh, he's only had 20 starts after that year off, so I'm sure this horse is just starting to come into his own. Like, I mean, look at him right here. I mean, he's huge down the lane. That's a good horse that he went by, and, uh, you know, like I said, I'm just ecstatic. I can't believe how Grady raced and uh, you know I'm honored to drive him. Well hopefully next week you'll get a chance to go for the big money and uh, that's Pacific Fellow and 153 and $101.60 is the win price. Thanks Randy. Thanks a lot Karen.